Hi there, I'm Lorraine from Easy Sew SA. In this video I'm going to show you how to work with a rolled hem foot. I prefer to work with lightweight to medium weight cotton fabric. Keep in mind that the rolled hem foot works better with straight seams. Fold your fabric over the same width as the rolled piece on your foot. Make sure that it's the correct width and then fold it over again. Slide your fabric in between the bottom plate and the rolled piece. Push the double fold through the rolled piece. Check the layers and see if they are all lined up. Your fabric might move away on the inside of the fold when you push it through. Take a pin and just move every layer so that it lines up at the edge. Then pull the fabric through to the bottom of the foot and then make sure that the fold is the correct width at the edge. Put a pin in on the edge to keep it in place. If the fabric does not line up on the edge, then it will go skew to the bottom as you sew. Fold the fabric in below the foot and then hold it at the top and the bottom and pull it straight. Now move the foot up and then clip it onto the machine. The needle should go in on the edge of the fabric and also be on the edge of the fold. Let the needle down, lift the foot up, take the pin out and then let the foot down again. Then roll the fabric over at the bottom more or less the same width and keep your finger on as you sew. The foot will keep it in the correct width. Now I'm going to show you how to sew the corner. Because the fabric is already thick at the corner, we are going to insert the foot under the thick part. Slide the fabric through the opening in the rolled hem part of the foot. Fold the edge in at the bottom and then move it further until it's folded in double. See that the edges line up at the bottom. Put a pin in and then fold it over again. Then fold it in double at the top corner the width that it should be. Put a pin in. Fold the foot over and pull the fabric on both sides of the foot so that the fabric moves in place. Move the foot up, clip the foot on your machine, let the needle down, lift the foot up and take the pin out. If your machine struggles to sew over thick parts, you can do the stitches on the thick part by turning the hand wheel. Remember to do back stitch. Then hold the thread at the back of the foot and then you can pull it a little bit when you start sewing. Then sew the rest of the seam. The next corner will start on the raw edge of your fabric, so you can just slide it in. The same as we did on the first seam. The last seam will have finished corners on both sides. So you will slide the foot in as we did on the second seam. 